Hi, my name is Christy Blatchford, and I'm the Quartz columnist uh, for Post Media and the National Post. First thing I should do is warn you that I'm not a lawyer and I've had no legal training, so you must take nothing I say, uh, you know, as gospel. However, I've been a criminal court reporter for about four decades, um, so I've learned a thing or two in all that time. Today I want to talk about sentencing. The fundamental thing about sentencing that I think people should realize is, as with everything else in the justice system, it's highly individualized. The former Harper government, for instance, brought in a whole bunch of what are called mandatory minimum sentences, and that meant that, for instance, if you were caught carrying a prohibited weapon during the commission of a crime, you would get an automatic, I think it was a three-year minimum mandatory sentence. Tailoring a sentence to fit somebody who's been convicted of a crime is mostly art and much less science. The judge has to weigh who the, the person is. Was he an upstanding citizen until this particular event and crime? Does he have a criminal record? Does he have good community support? Uh, you know, how egregious, how violent was the crime itself. I'm always grateful that I'm not a judge uh, when I, I see how hard it is to sentence people. Canada is blessed with a, a really good judiciary. Most of our judges are smart, you know, experienced, filled with common sense sort of people. So I, I think that they, and the lawyers, of course, you know, never forget the lawyers as much as we all tell lawyers jokes. When you're in trouble, you ain't got no friend like your lawyer. And I, I never take lightly how seriously these guys defend their clients, how seriously I would want them to defend me were I their client, and prosecutors who have to prosecute with the same sort of vigor that a defense lawyer has, but has to do it on behalf of the good of the community, really. As with everything in the court system, it's all about the facts of a particular case and the accused and the uh, guilty, uh, the victim, and the nature of the crime. You know, you want to decry the crime and uh, denounce the behavior, but you don't want to, you know, so punish somebody that you flatten them, especially a young person.